Get your materials ready. So you need your student workbook, pages 44 and 45. Um, we are going to do the first problem together. Um, so grab those um, pages and a pencil. Don't forget to put your name on your paper. Um, the first problem, penguin problem separating. So there are 11 penguins on the ice. Then three of them dove into the water. How many penguins are left on the ice? So we can see our equation here. Um, and we have the total is unknown. Um, so we have our 11 on the ice and they subtracted three to get to our total here. So we can show that on the number rack. I'm gonna move five and five. So I'm moving 10 over and one more to equal 11. And we subtracted three from this 11. So let's take away three, one, two, and three. How many do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So our answer here would be eight. And we can, that's kind of a wonky eight. Give me one second. There we go. Um, so we can also use our picture on our paper to help us. So there are 11 on the ice. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11. That's how many we have. And then we can cross out these three that jumped in the water. So when we count our total, we don't need to count those. So let's count how many we see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8 was our answer. Um, and so your next problem has um, the part unknown, so the middle part. We have 10 minus something equals 3. So when we read our problem, there are 10 penguins on the ice. That's where we get our 10 from. Some of them dove into the water. And now there are only three penguins left on the ice. So how many penguins dove into the water? Um, so you can see our um, we have a question mark here. We don't know. It doesn't show us. Um, so we need to figure out how we can um, do this problem with our number rack, or you can use um, a different strategy. I'm going to move over the first 10. Oops. Okay, so I have our 10, and then we know we some of them dove in the water to get our total to 3, so we need to subtract um, from our 10 till we get down to these 3. Um, so here's 10. There's 1. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Um, that puts me at three um, left, and so seven would be our answer there. Okay, so I have given you the first two problems, um, the first two answers. So um, do three, four, five, and six, and don't forget to put your name on your paper. Great job today.